swimming as the IHSAA sport came to Evansville Vanderburg School Corporation in the fall of 2003. Swimming is one of the toughest sports. It requires using the entire body, arms, legs, and torso. Swimmers don't swim for glory or press. You rarely see an article about swimming outside of the Olympics. Swimmers train and compete because they love the sport and want to fulfill their dreams. In this segment, Community Link journalist Sky Smith meets with the Wrights High School swim team Phenom and IU commit Lily King. Lily has swum and won many competitions, including the Junior Pan Packs in Hawaii, Indiana State Championships, and more. Thanks for meeting with me today, Lily. Yeah, no problem. Um, how many years have you been swimming? Uh, I've been swimming for 10 years now. 10 years? Yeah. Um, there are four main strokes. Uh, which one do you swim competitively? I swim, well, I swim the individual medley, so I swim all of them competitively, um, but my main stroke is breaststroke. How often do you practice? Usually during high school season, um, I practice twice a day, three days a week, and then the other days, um, I just practice once a day. So usually about nine, uh, nine to 10 practices a week. And what's a typical practice like? A typical practice, usually in the mornings, I, I don't do a lot. I just focus on technique. It's usually only about an hour. And then in the afternoons, I usually do like my high yardage practices, more um, intense sets. So usually trying to get my work in at, at night. Since you mainly swim breaststroke, is that what you focus on during practice mostly? Usually I try to focus on like my weaker strokes since I do some individual medley. Um, I do have to work on my other strokes a lot because I'm pretty weak in those. Um, but uh, definitely competitions mostly focusing on breaststroke. During your high school season at Wrights, what are your practices and meets like? Um, my practices during high school season usually aren't as intense as they are during club season because we have such a wide range of kids who are swimming because we've had kids who are, have been swimming since they were little and swimming club. And then we also have a bunch of kids who have just started swimming uh, once, once they get to high school. So the practices usually aren't as like high intensity as they are when I'm with club. Uh, the meets are so much fun during high school season. Um, usually like during club, it's more individualized and and you're not really focusing on the team part, but then once you get to high school, it's very team oriented and then it's just a lot of fun to swim with your peers. All of the EVSC high schools swim at the Lloyd. Uh, where do you do your specialty practices? And I'm in the morning. I have morning practices at Castle. Um, I swim there pretty much by myself in the morning um, with the master's group, which is like the, the older swimmers. And then um, during the afternoons, I do practice at Lloyd. I usually start around five, so about five to six in the morning and then leave, get up, ready to go to school, and then just go throughout my day after that. So. Gotcha. And what's the difference from short course and long course? Short course, um, during high school we swim short course yards, so that's uh, 25 yards. And then um, long course meters is 50 meters long, and that's, uh, that's the Olympic length. So we do not swim the Olympic <laughs> length during high school season. Um, but, but that's just like a United States thing that uh, we swim short course yards in the winter, and then we swim long course meters in the summer. I know you recently committed to IU. What made you choose IU? I really felt at home when I went on my trip to IU. Um, I don't know, the team was great. I really got along well with everybody. I've known the coach for a long time. <laughs> and um, just like, you know, during the recruiting process, you're getting calls all the time and emails. And it's, it's really overwhelming. Um, but I feel, felt like um, the coach at IU, Ray Luz, he really, he kind of out-recruited everybody. So he's, he, you know, he stayed on me, he kept emailing me. So I felt like I knew him a lot better than I knew some of the other coaches, um, just simply because we talked a lot more, you know, and uh, it was really nice that it was close to home. I really, before this year, I didn't, I thought I wanted to go far away, but um, after my trip, I was, I was like, you know, it'd really be nice to only be like an hour and a half, two hours away from home. What drives you to swim? I really love to race and I love winning and I really hate losing. Um, I think that's part of what makes um, the elite swimmers so great is that they hate to lose more than they love to win. And um, every, like you ask any, any little kid, any young swimmer, what do you want to do? And they, what do you want to do in the sport? And they're like, oh, I want to make the Olympic team. I want to win an Olympic gold medal. And then once you get to this level where it actually looks like you can make the team, it's like, okay, I have to do everything possible that I can in order to reach this goal. So really, um, just setting goals for yourself and then, and then trying to accomplish them. I mean, that's what drives me. I've never really had any motivation issues. I know um, some of my friends have, <laughs> um, just trying to be motivated to keep swimming, especially like the older professional swimmers. But really, I'm just enjoying the ride right now, <laughs> and hopefully it'll keep going. Do you have a piece of advice for younger swimmers? Yeah, for the younger kids, uh, really just have fun with it. It's a fun sport. It's really hard. Uh, keep working hard, um, but don't don't get too caught up in it. Just have fun with it, 
you know, you win some, you lose some. It's not the end of the world. There's always going to be another meet. So just continue to work hard and have fun. Next year, you'll be going to IU. Do you have goals beyond IU? Yeah, definitely making the Olympic team uh, 2016 Rio. Let's hope. <laughs> but uh, yeah, definitely making the team. Um, probably some NCAA titles, individual and team titles, hopefully. Uh, we can get there. But uh, just trying to keep swimming as long as I can and enjoy it. Thank you for meeting with me today, and good luck on your season. Thanks. I'm Sky Smith reporting for Bossy's EVSC Community Link.